hell is going on guys hope you guys are all having a fantastic day guys welcome to the free portion of the official Boogeyman, Stromedy members only movie. Guys, this movie is about to be absolutely insane. So guys, grab your cucumbers, grab your blueberries, grab your David, grab your Yanas and Vows because this one is about to be freaking ludicrous, baby. Growing up in the Toronto area, there was this urban legend about the real Boogeyman house that exists about three and a half hours away. This was the story that haunted us as kids. Guys, if you don't know what the Boogeyman is, then I don't know what kind of rock you've been living under the boogeyman has got to be known as one of the scariest and most evil monsters that terrorize kids all over the world the one thing i'm happy about is that we actually live pretty far away from the boogeyman so there were only stories growing up and we actually never encountered it but today you're telling me we're going to see the boogeyman in flesh david take it easy okay, all okay, right okay okay this isn't one of those videos that were over the top dramatic okay but i'm just a bit nervous bro the boogeyman but here's the thing about the boogeyman He's apparently a paranormal entity that can exist in multiple places at once. So if you're not on your best behavior, you could be having a meet and greet with the boogeyman tonight. Can't the boogeyman also like shapeshift into different things in order to trick you? I swear I've heard that before. The boogeyman preys on your worst fears and brings that to life, guys. You wouldn't believe this, but we're gonna be staying at the house for two days trying to find that boogeyman. Wait, uh, we're sleeping at the house? So guys, I actually didn't inform them on this because how how else would I have got them to agree to the video? But yeah, we're gonna be uh, something along the lines of that nature. What? We're sleeping in the boogeyman house. I we mean, how else are we gonna get a banger video from the show? Dude, this conjuring thing all over again, and yeah. that was terrifying. Yeah, 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 yeah. I did not sign up. For yeah, that we didn't know that. The conjuring house was one thing, if you guys remember that video, but the boogeyman house? I mean, guys, let's be quite frank. We're <laughs> so guys, if you are ready for this, drop a like, hit that subscribe button because we're about to meet the family that has grown up in the infamous Boogeyman house. We're about to learn their stories, we're gonna sleep the night, and we're gonna document anything that we experience. The family claims to have been growing up hearing noises, whispering, seeing shadows, hearing things come from the closet. Wait, seriously? Yes. Seriously, Yana. I don't wanna do this, this is actually really scary. We haven't done this in a while. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be Kyle, I didn't sign up for that, bro! Guys, as you can see, David is ecstatic for this video. And if you guys want to watch the full entire thing, it's gonna be available on Stromedy members. Click the link in the description. You're gonna get to watch the first 20 to 25 minutes for free. And then after that, you'll have to join Stromedy members, guys. I'm gonna put some clips right here of everything we experienced. Guys, check it out. Goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye. Yo, 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 Right now. Okay guys, let's not waste any more time. We have a three and a half hour drive. Come on guys, oh let's, go, let's go, let's okay, go, let's go. Let's go. All right, Stromedy Squad, and without further ado, we are on our way. There's no turning back now, guys. Yo, now that I'm thinking about it, like, do we actually realize what we're doing? Oh, I've been thinking about it, Stromedy Squad. We've done a lot of things on this channel, and guys, I know, I know, I know. Please, let it go. I know. We've done just about everything there is to do and see on this channel, but the Boogeyman? I mean, guys, let's be real. That is one that I don't think we're prepared for. The Boogeyman? Yeah, Boogeyman. because we've been hearing about him since childhood, right? That's all you hear about you don't want to ever meet the boogeyman i'm still a bit skeptical though i don't really think the boogeyman is real i mean it's just a myth See, to make kids you know scared and stuff people like, that say that, that, that are gonna the be person. that's david's famous last words yeah. guys cut to a quick clip of david absolutely shitting his pants <laughs> but guys as i said before we have about a three and a half hour drive yo i think the part i'm most scared for is when we're sleeping i want to do a clip recording all of us sleeping in the beds and see if we can catch anything oh, and then you watch it back yeah. and see if anything moves. We should even do the thing they did in Paranormal Activity where they put the powder on the ground and they try to see if they can see footsteps. Oh, the flower, oh. yeah, the Wait, flower. you said you had something, yeah, like actually, information about the boogeyman? Many individuals and residents and neighbors have reported doors opening and closing on their own, lights being turned on and off long after
helicopter building was disconnected from electricity. Wait, so we could lose electricity and just be there in the dark? If there's, there's one no thing you do not want to be in when you're in the boogeyman house, it's in the dark. Okay, that is where the boogeyman thrives. You guys know the boogeyman? He's under your bed. He's in the closet. If there's one thing I'm sure about Stromedy Squad, it's I, I do not want to be face to face with the boogeyman. Okay, so there's how many of us here? There's five of us. Five. Who's going to meet the boogeyman first? David, because he, he doubted him. Oh, fam. The yeah. boogeyman is You're real. actually first to go for sure. Bro, the boogeyman is not real, bro. Trust Stop me. Stop saying I... that, dude. Bro, he wants to are... prove himself to people who doubt so, him. So a little story we heard when we were kids. But at the end of the day, I mean, if it is real, I guess we're going to see, but Yo, come what if, on. Guys, what if we wake up and we find Alex levitating like this out of oh his bed? Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, I'm out. I'm sorry, Alex. I'm leaving you. I'm running. Yeah, Alex. I'm sorry, but you're on your own for that one. All right, guys. I'll pick it up when we get a little bit closer. All right, guys. We have been driving for about two and a half hours now. As you can see, we're an hour 23 away. And guys, throughout this entire ride, all we've been talking about is just how much we might regret going to this house. We've been looking up articles about the history of this house. And apparently there's a lot more history than we thought that dates back all the way to World War One. What was your article saying, Yana? Okay, this is like a little bit of a longer story, but basically a girl and her boyfriend went to stay the night at this place and they said apparently the whole thing smelled like sewage the moment they walked in and when she was getting ready the mirror started shaking Jesus. like it was shaking as she was putting her hair up so they ran downstairs they said that it was like going on and they told them yes this place is haunted what are we getting ourselves into i, I might have to see it this. to believe it we're about to find out in the next hour 20. i found an old family photo where a little girl died and her husband hanged himself at and this house that we're going to at this house Okay. So, and neighbors have heard noises of little girl and a husband screaming. It's gonna be so scary. Well, the story I have is really messed up. It's about a family. They went to go like check into this place. They went to go visit it, and overnight they just heard like crying, like like a baby, like yeah, an infant. I've seen so many articles saying people are hearing yeah. crying. Maybe like, it's what, that girl. But, like, right? What's crazy about this story is like this was a young family. Like they had a kid, and they thought it was their baby, right? So they go check in the room for the baby, and the baby's not there. But the whole night they're hearing crying. Wait, the crying. baby's not there? Like the baby went missing. But what? There's like, there's like spirits of young children that have been terrorized by the boogeyman. And so you hear their crying but at like night. The scariest part about that is like, till this day, like that kid has not been found. Throughout their whole night, they heard the baby crying. Do you think he's still somewhere in the house? Yo, you know what I think we should do when we get there? Stromedy Squad, guys. I say we go in the closet where they claim the boogeyman lives. And we uh, try to talk to it, but have the voice memo thing recording. You want us to go to the closet exactly where the boogeyman is in the dark and have a conversation with him do some chit chatting what did you think we were here to do have a tea party with the boogeyman i mean that's, that's essentially what you're suggesting yeah bro i'm saying we just go in and go out strong squad there's only one way to find out what's true and what's not but david if you go in the closet with me i'll give you a pop tag <sighs> how long like like two seconds you'll just have to see and find out no nah, that's not worth it bro that's not no worth it. you're not gambling no nah, no nah. It was gonna be a two minute pop tag. Two nope, minutes. Nope, feels now. Off. Nope. And for that reason, I'm out. Wait, what's the rooming situation there? How many rooms? Six. Okay, well, we're not gonna need more than one room because we're all sleeping together in a little ball, huddled like this, making sure no one touches us, okay? Okay. Well, good. what about my snoring? You guys complain about it all the time. Dude, I would rather hear your snores than a demon. I'm good. No, I no, say, no. I'd rather get possessed. <laughs> I don't wanna so listen I to say, David snoring. <laughs> I say snoring. we get a hotel, and it's gonna be compliments at the company. <laughs> I'm getting a painful Can I get your finest sweet, well, please? Well, I have no service. Rest in peace, guys. You know shit is about to go down when there's no service. Yeah, if something cool. happens to us, we're on we're, our own. We're on our own. Well, we have the truck. I mean, we could just skirt out of there. I'm running to the woods. Oh, Bye. girl. <laughs> the woods? See, guys, this is what I'm talking about. What the hell? How does he fall asleep? Is he still snoring? Yeah. Oh my god, yo! <laughs> that was a little warm up for the boogeyman. <laughs> This, this is the part where you look on the news and you see a bunch of kids that went missing. Is this it? Yeah. yeah. Is that actually it? Oh, 
the Old Mill Manor 1812. Guys, there it is right there. Stromity Squad, we just pulled up. This place looks seriously creepy. It's not what's on the outside, it's what's on the inside, guys. And it's one thing to see this place during the day, but it's another to be here at night. Yo, yo, Stromity Squad, I'm not getting a good vibe right now. You guys are so lucky you get to stay safe behind your screens right now while we do all the dirty work. We're willing to get possessed for you guys right now, okay? If that doesn't deserve a like, what does? And while you're at it, hit the subscribe button. Five point one million and counting, baby. All right, Stromity Squad, and we just arrived at the official Boogeyman house. Oh. What do you mean? We're here to stay at the house. What's that? You don't want to go in that house. Why? Why? There's lots of scary sh going on in that house. Trust me. You don't want to go in. Scary sh You don't want to go in? Sir, wait, wait, can you tell us, please? Yeah, can you explain? What the hell was that about? He just said, That's turn back, time. you're gonna regret it? Bro, he could just be trolling, bro. I think he's, he's not trolling. Why would an he's old not man trolling. not troll? Yeah. Guys, this entire area is giving me a weird vibe. Like, look at it. If this is how I'm already feeling on the outside, imagine what we're gonna feel on the inside. So, Stromedy Squad, apparently the family that resides in this house, or should I say that once resided in this house, now rents it out because experiences with the boogeyman has gotten too much for them to handle. As I mentioned in the intro, they dealt with everything from hearing weird noises coming coming from the closet, the attic, under their bed, seeing shadows, getting weird vibes, shifts in temperatures, all the things that point to paranormal activity. And they couldn't handle it anymore. So, and so now the house is up for rent. For anybody who has enough bravery to stay the night, we're gonna go meet with them right now. Dude, this, this is, this is really nerve wracking. This right here is the start of what could be a very eventful night, guys. Or this could be the start to the end, bro. Like, yeah. you don't know what we're walking. It could literally be it. the beginning of the end. Guys, look at it. Already, like, just the way the house looks is already giving me, like, boogeyman vibes. They make it all welcoming in the front and everything. Like, they have made it very welcoming. I think that's to try to hide the fact that this house is so haunted. It's to try to, like, brighten up the mood. Yeah, you know? yeah, for sure. Yo, yeah, yo, I don't, I don't want to knock. Whoa, I don't want to knock. Okay, okay, okay. You're the tough okay. one. Yo, David, David. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Silly. This is not the time to be doing. Hello, welcome, honey. Look who's here. Come on in. It's my husband, Jamie. Hello. Hi. Hi. Come Hi. In. It's cold out Hi, there. Hi, Kyle. I'm Sonia. Nice to see you. Sonia, nice to meet you. Hey guys. Hi. Hi, everyone. Come on in. Hi, it's man. cold out. Oh, you have such a nice home. Hi. Guys. What's your name? Thank Hi. you. Chat. Kyle. Hi, my name's Tim. Kyle, nice to meet you. Hi. All right, awesome. Would you you like guys don't mind us filming, right? No, We're just gonna no, film the whole of process. Not. Stuff. Would you like a little tour of the house before you get settled? Yeah, please. And yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, yeah, to drink. Yeah, that'd be good. Uh, no, no, we're good. Maybe I'll get yeah. water. Yeah. Yeah, I'll yeah get we're good. Strongly squad, look at this place. If you can just take your shoes off, please. He doesn't like it very much. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, no problem. All right. Yeah, of course, of course, we don't want to upset him. Just... So let's make sure that the shoes are kept nice and tidy, so yeah. he is satisfied. Yeah, we we've worked our entire life to to keep him keep him happy, keep him at bay. Oh, who who are you guys talking about? The boogeyman. The boogeyman. Let's just okay, okay, yeah, let's just okay. make sure they're nice and tidy. Yeah, of course. Anything for uh, him. Okay, Stromity Squad. We are already off to a very creepy start. This is crazy. Oh yeah, uh, you guys can give us a tour for sure. Sure, you have your water, you're good to go. Yeah, and nobody so else needs anything? Uh, no, no, no. No, all right, and the shoes look great. Thank you, everyone. So we'll start here on the first floor, just to sew in case you need anything, more water, coffee, anything. We have a kitchen right this way. Yeah, they're actually very nice. Yeah, but a bit so too nice. all redone. We've had a few little problems with lighting and uh, electricity, and sometimes things flicker a bit. The older light fixtures still flicker on and off. And that wouldn't have anything to do with the boogeyman, would it? Well, the lights flicker when he gets very angry. It often reflects his emotions. Well, sometimes I think maybe he's just hungry. <laughs> Guys, let's not scare our guests. They're they're here to enjoy a night at uh, our home. Sometimes he gets just a little funny, and but we we think we've sorted everything out, right, honey? I think so. Yeah. Well, let's continue with the tour for now. I, I think that that would be good. If you do come in and make anything, please make sure that you leave everything just exactly as you found it, because um oh. Uh. He likes things to be kept very tidy, so everything's in its place. Honey, I'm sure that these people will take care of our house just as we would. Yeah, yes, of course. Of course you will. Yes, um, so would you like to see the dining room? Yeah, yeah, that, that would be great. I would love to see the dining room. Right this way. Do you? Oh, what are they going on about this? He 
super nervous. Like there's like a weird vibe. Yeah, this so is like a weird, weird energy. I feel like this should have just been a crew <laughs> smiling at me. Strong Squad, I'm getting a weird vibe from these people. Like, what do, what do they mean by he likes things kept tidy? The book I don't know. They're talking about like a third person, a third entity. Okay, let's just keep going. Okay, they're gonna notice we've found him. Let's hurry up, please. He doesn't like to be kept waiting. Oh yes, of course. Uh, yeah, please stay with the group. Really, it's best that you not fall behind. Right this way. So if you decide to come in and have dinner, we have the dining room all set up for you. Just make sure that you leave everything set just as it is. And no, 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 get up, 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 Boogeyman's seat, and oh. he really doesn't like it when somebody else sits oh. there. Oh, oh, my apologies. Sorry. Oh, God. Okay. Um, oh, let's just go to the next room. Yeah, yeah. yeah sorry. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. sorry. I, I, I didn't know it was like that. Okay, so we're going to head upstairs. Um, if you could maybe just keep the camera not so focal. He doesn't really like his picture taken. I know he said that it was okay, and it is. It really is okay, but if maybe he doesn't notice it so much, that would be good. That okay, yeah, no worries. Alex, just... All right. Kat, Tim, why don't you um, take them up and show them your rooms, and your dad and I will just make sure nobody gets lost. Oh, it's not that big of a um, uh, so this store, this house actually has a very fun history. The owners of the house who originally built it back in uh, 1842, as you can see, this is a picture of them here. They built the house and they um, uh, they did have a son um, um, that they had way back then, but um, um, they, we don't quite know what happened to him, but he's he's not important. If you'll come this way over to the um, uh, bathroom, as you can see this boat, um, uh, the blue nose. Oh, the original wow. owners of the house, um, uh, they were on this, um, uh, 1880 uh, and they had originally um, when they were on the boat the boat sank and sadly they died my grandparents they were the ones who bought this house and it's come down to us however our grandparents when they originally moved in they got a letter saying that the son of the owners deserved to live in this house and that it was his right to live in this house however our grandparents refused they said that they bought the house and they deserved to live here apparently my grandparents never heard from the son again but I'm sure he lived a nice life. Anyways, I'm here. Let's go Somewhere. ahead and move on now. Come on, let's continue with the tour, everybody. Let's move on. What happened? Yeah. Right this way. Strongly Squad, I'm trying to understand the story here. Of the house and the family. So we're not really quite sure what happened to the son, but there are some rumors that he possibly drowned here, which is why I do want you to be very careful if you go out near here. The, the water can run very fast, and it's it's really still quite yeah. cold at this time of year. So the first room we're going to show you is the least active room in the house. Like paranormal-wise, you mean? Yeah, it's the quietest. If you want to get any footage tonight, of course, probably not in this room. Cool. Okay. Yeah, this room feels like... Yeah, it feels like action. Yeah, it doesn't feel as, like... I don't get as weird of a vibe in this room. Are like we sleeping room. in this room? Yeah. yeah I, I, think I, I call dibs on this room for no, sure. No, I do. Let me tell you. And there's another one right across the hall. So, Tim, why don't you show them your room? Um, uh, so this is my room. This is definitely one of the more active rooms. I grew up hearing a lot of sounds from that closet over there, so I, I would just um, stay away from that closet if you're ever in here. Okay, uh, that's good to know. Yeah, uh, I mean, we don't what know what kind of what kinds of sounds and things would you see? Sometimes I hear knocks on the door, and I would see shadows and hear some voices, specifically around 3 a.m. 3 a.m. seemed to be the time where he was most active. As long as you follow his rules and don't disturb him, he won't hurt you. Okay, that's, that's, that's good to know. That's, that's not fair. How hard is it to follow the rules? So, you want to follow me up here? Now, this is the most active floor of the house. This is where you'll hear all the sounds, see the shadows. So this is the, the most knocking. active? Like, this is where this we'll is get the where most paranormal activity? The where he likes to play the most? Oh my god. Strawberries. Oh, Jesus Christ. This is definitely very, very boogeyman-ish. Now this here is my room. Now this is my room right here. This is the room with the most activity. This is the room with the most activity? Yes, especially oh, at night. Yo, it's way colder in here. Do you feel that? Yeah. Yo, you come in and Please immediately listen. get like goosebumps. <laughs> especially oh. at night, he likes to sit here. Please don't sit here. Sometimes I'd wake up at 3 a.m. and see it moving. The rocking chair? Yes. 
And whatever you do, do not open the closet doors. This is where he stays throughout the day. Don't be surprised if you see it opening and closing throughout the day. It's just him checking up on you guys. Okay, well, I think that's enough. You guys have seen the house. You can all choose your room. You know where you're going to be tonight. And I think that we need to be on our way. Yes, yes dear? Yes, we do. Kat, yes. everybody have their stuff? Well, we're going to be on our way now. On our way. You guys have a great night and uh, rest well. Okay, let's go, guys. Help me go. Um, all right, play nice. You be good. Be nice to them. Please make, please make sure you keep everything the way that you found it. Oh, yes, they will. I'm sure they will here. Right? Okay, now don't be too harsh on them. Please remember to treat them appropriately. Play nice. Please don't hurt them. Play well together. Quickly. Yo, where are they going? Are they just leaving? Did they spring off? Follow them. They're getting all their stuff. Okay, everybody, let's get going. Please don't make this more difficult for us. We did our part. Stick to the deal. Come on, let's go, honey. Okay. Yo, what the hell? What do they mean by that? Did you hear her say, like, don't hurt them? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Wait, did they leave? Yeah, yeah, look, look. What's the weirdest thing I've ever heard of? Wait, did they come in? I thought they were going to stick around for a lot longer and they suddenly just leave. Okay, Stromedy Squad, so we have officially made it to the part of the video where we are left alone in the house. The part that I dreaded the most. And the part that the Stromedy Squad, I know you guys are most excited for. Something was really up with that family. Dude, the mom yeah. was being super sus. Weird how she was like randomly nice throughout the whole tour. She's like, okay guys, why don't you do it? Like, yeah, but they were being a little too nice. Yeah, and that's what was bugging me. And did you hear what they were saying at the end? They were saying like, play nice, uh, play nice, yeah, don't, don't hurt, hurt them. them. I don't know what what's going on, but what I do know, there's an ulterior motive here with this family, and I can't quite point my finger on it, but something does not feel right. Yo, did you notice at the end, the mom said we held up our end of the deal? Yeah, what was that about? Because I know we didn't make so any deal with them. So ulterior motive, for sure, what deal? Are we part of some plan? I was seeing a whole bunch of reviews on Google of people that previously stayed at this house saying that the family was acting extremely weird, visiting many times early in the morning to check up on them. Not only do we have to worry about the boogeyman, but we have to worry about this family. Okay, no, let's not think about that, okay, bro? The family was actually kind of nice. They and were they just left. a bit they weird, left. okay? But now they're not here anymore. It's just us and the boogeyman. So let's focus on what's at hand right now. Now, guys, I haven't noticed anything yet, but it was more about the way I felt walking through the rooms, especially upstairs. Did you guys feel that? Like yeah. the heaviness in your chest. Yeah, and like the, the cold, temperature, yeah. The temperature changed, yeah. It felt extremely yeah. cold. And they usually say that a drop in temperature is directly connected to, like, spiritual activity. Yeah. The moment we walked into the daughter's room, I got goosebumps. Like, where the closet is, like the blue closet. Yeah. Uh, I don't like that closet at all. You, you know she mentioned that that's where he stays throughout the day. Yeah, so what said he's it, oh, there like, right now? I don't know. But guys, Stromedy Squad, you've probably seen this before. This is an EMF reader. So it's supposed to pick up on electromagnetic signals throughout the house. People often use these in paranormal investigations to see which parts of the house have stronger activity than others. So if you turn it on here, if it senses any weird activity in the room, it'll start to light up red. So what I say we do is walk throughout the entire house and see where we can get the strongest signals. Yeah. That's right. Okay. Let's start with... I mean, right here is green, so I think... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, she was saying there was some activity in the kitchen, so I'm gonna... Oh, yo, it just went red around me! <laughs> 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 what? Alright, so I'm gonna squad. We're gonna start in the kitchen. Remember when she was saying that he likes the kitchen kept tidy? It's pretty tidy. Wait, well, so what if we what? try to mess it up? Exactly, if we mess it up, it maybe. Red. Yeah, if we messed it up, maybe that could be a way to lure out you spiritual know, the activity. The first thing she did was rearrange like the spices, so hold yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. How are we supposed to walk? I think we're getting way too ahead of ourselves. We don't want to piss off the boogeyman five minutes into our stay. So remember she said that there, that's his seat? Yeah, yeah, yeah. he likes to sit there. Stromedy Squad, we're gonna put the EMF reader near the chair, see if we can get any signal. <gasps> Wait, what? Look, 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 like just barely, you see that? Look, if I put it near the chair. <gasps> you see that, you see that, you see that? Stromedy Squad, it's picking up something. <gasps> oh. Yo, 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 yo. Look at that, look, look. 
Look, 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 look. Yo. Yo, it's going crazy right now. Dude, back off. Look, it doesn't do this at any of the other chairs. You see? Look, it's literally only here. Maybe that's why they were like really adamant about me not sitting there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe because it's not even safe for you to sit there. Okay, now I actually just got okay, yeah, like yeah, yeah. chills. Body chills. Strummy squad, this always happens. We're always joking around until something yeah. until really, until we actually experience something. Look how strong it is. That's pretty strong. It's like three bars. You notice how it's not consistent too? Yeah. Maybe that's because like he's not here right now, but he was earlier. Okay, let's just keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Strong on the chair over there. Yeah, very. Oh, that's the parents. This room. whole part's super creepy too. This is where he was explaining the story about the two people that died and then their son went missing. Remember the mom said that there was a rumor about him drowning in, in the river over there? Maybe we should go and see if it reacts to the boat. Stromedy Squad, I think what we're picking up from the story is, is that the owners of this house, the parents, ended up selling the house to the family that just gave us the tour. The son thought that he had the rights to live in the house. And I think when they sold it to this family, the son was like offended by that. And that's why he haunts this house and anybody who comes in it. So he's he angry. thinks it's his. You know? So the son might be the boogeyman. The son is probably <gasps> what they refer as the boogeyman. This makes sense. This is really scary. Because like technically he's still living here. He never got over the yeah. fact that he couldn't. Exactly. So he exactly. doesn't want other people in his house, which makes sense. Like This is the washroom where he yeah. was explaining the story. This is a model of the boat where the people that own this house died. Remember it sank? Yeah, that's what the sun was saying. Try yeah. to bring it like closer. Let's see. Oh yo. Oh. Oh, right at the, yeah. Oh, you see that? Right where the boat is. Oh, it oh. Just went red. It, it just went red, red for a second. Isn't it crazy that it's right where the lifeboats are too? Wait, stop. It's not. The original owners of this house, they probably have some sort of like spiritual connection to this model of the ship that they were on. Uh, okay, let's keep going, let's yeah, keep going. Please. Oh, yo, guys, this is the pictures they were talking about. Oh, yeah. I think this right here, these were the two people that originally owned the house. For the sure. two people that died on the boat. Look, these are the stages of the home too. And then, one of these people here was the son. I think it was this one right here. Oh, that's actually the letter that he told us about. The one that he wrote to the people that were selling the house? Yeah. Damn, guys, there's a ton of history in this house. We still have the EMF reader going right now. So I say we start in the room where they say that there was the least amount of activity. Yeah, I feel like that's the least amount of activity. Strongest squad, this house is so creepy. Like, I cannot imagine myself living in this house full time. Let alone, like, look, there, there's literally neighbors right there. Imagine being the house that lives next to this yeah. place. Guys, I That's think great. I might want to sleep in this room. This room feels like the best in this house so far that we've been in. Yeah, well, she literally said, like, this is the most quiet room in yeah. the house, like, least active. We're not getting any readings on the EMF, try so. Try to bring it, like, around the to, bed. Yeah, yeah. Move it around. Maybe bring it beside picture frame with the boat. Oh yeah, about? yeah. Nah, there's literally nothing in here. I don't know, like, I don't get a weird vibe in this room. Yeah, neither do I, man. Okay, let's go to the next room. Let's go to the next room. Strongy Squad, guys, stay close. If you guys notice anything in this house, weird signs, you hear anything, because usually microphones can pick up frequencies better than our human ears. So we need you guys to keep your ears peeled. Okay, so this was the son's room, right? Yeah. yeah. He mentioned the closet. Yeah, he said that he hasn't opened that closet in months. Look at this room. Like, this literally looks like a horror movie. Yeah, it does. But I don't mind spending the night here. I mean, it's pretty calm. He said he would usually be able to hear things. I don't really hear anything. Should we open it? No, no. He said he hasn't opened Dude, it in months. Dude, the handle is so cold. Seriously? I don't know. Strongly squad. I don't want to do it. Guys, what, what do you think? Should we open this? Yo, I'm actually so nervous yeah, right now. Really bad. I don't know, I'm getting like a weird feeling, but... Yo, I usually don't get this nervous in videos. I just feel like we're gonna see something crazy tonight. And once one thing happens, it's gonna start a chain reaction. And it's getting darker too, so the vibes are like changing. Okay, chill. If he said, bro, if he said he hasn't opened it in months, don't open Dude, it. we have to open it. I feel like we should at least just put the EMF reader in there once. Yeah. Okay, ready? Okay, three, two... Should I, should I go in? Just be careful, bro, chill. Is it cold in there? Oh, yeah, it feels significantly colder. Does it? Way colder. Why like, is there a mirror in here? Why would he need a mirror in here? Yeah, There's nothing no. in there. Are you getting anything? No. Should we be more like... There's no reading in here. Man. Should we go upstairs? I mean, I guess. Okay, yeah, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's where the boogeyman room is. Yeah, the, I really don't want to go know. into the daughter's room because that's like where it's going to be the worst, 100%. No, you're not on that side. 
that's where it's going to be the best footage. Here, this is Okay, Astronomy Squad, so this is the third floor on the house. This is the floor where they said the most amount of activity happens in the house. I don't like the smell here, it's weird. Yeah, it smells different. It smells yeah, weird. it's like, it's oh, colder it's and different. Cold. Oh, it is cold up here. Should we start? What was that? Stop. <laughs> what, what, what? I just got, I heard a bump and I got scared. Well, they said they would hear noises. No, but I heard like something in. literally downstairs, I'm not joking. Right just now? Yeah. Wait, wait, hold okay. on. What? what is that? It, it wasn't there before. If that is not creepy, then I don't know what is. See what I mean about how much colder it is in here? Yeah. Oh, it actually is. Yeah. Strawberry Squad. Okay, so this was the daughter's room right here. And she said that she used to see this rocking chair moving. Apparently, that's the closet that we're not supposed to open. Okay, okay. Like, in all seriousness, let's not open it. I feel like we should just put uh, the EMF no, reader in there bro, quick. She said that's where he said deliberately stays, bro. She said, whatever you do, who's smiling? I don't have Strawberry Squad, I say we do it. I say we do it. Just quickly. Right now? Okay, okay. Dude, what if it, like, flies open or something? I'm not joking. We're literally in the middle of nowhere and no one has service. Yo, 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 yo. Here. Yo, what was that? Yeah, that was a light. That was a light. One really of you guys did that for sure. No, dude, I feel like literally something just came into the room. I'm not joking. Okay, can you close the door? Yo, 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 you guys feel that? Stop. Hey, bro, you guys feel that? This is messed up. No, it actually oh, just wait. felt like a rush. Actually it actually just felt like a rush. No, David, don't. No, we need to be together. Bro, bro. She said, don't open no, the like closet it. no matter what, and you just open it. Bro. Kyle, look at that. What, what, what? Oh my gosh. Okay, bro, this is not. Okay, cool. someone's no, messing Alex, with us. No, Alex, you moved that. You moved that. No, Alex, you moved that, did you? Nope. Bro, put that EMF reader there. Moving. <gasps> yo, 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 okay, yo, 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 look, when I take it away from the rocking chair, it goes back to green. Look at this. Bro, it's like, it's like, like violently going red, bro. Okay, um, can we just, okay. can we, like, not? Okay, yo, I said we, we just open this once. Why? And then, and then we, and then we don't come in this, and then we don't come in this room again, okay? Sure. Okay, strong as going. Why did she say, whatever you do, do not open this? Can you see the- Oh, oh yo, it's already going off. It's already going off. What? You see that? Yo, yo, yo. yo look, 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 look. Okay. Look. Yo, 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 yo. Oh, my God. Oh, chill. Okay, why are you, like, so close to me? Are you seeing that? Yes, of course, bro. Just- Strongly Squad, the EMF reader is picking up a really intense signal right now. Yo, 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 oh yo, yo, look yo, how strong that is. Going nuts. Where you go, like, yo, look how strong that is. In this corner, specifically. Okay, yo, yo. Okay, back yo, out. We get it. Okay, oh yeah, God. close the door, Dude, G. Come out. Show me, squad. Look at this. Look how strong. That's probably the strongest signal we've gotten in the house. In the one closet, and she pulled she us off to open. And she said specifically this place. Oh, my God. Yo, bro, it's tweaking right now, bro. Yo, yo it's, it's like heck, Dude, it's like oh, Yo, yo, oh yo, 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 yo. Turn it back on. Bro, yo, what just happened? What just happened? Who, did, who the touched light. the lights? Who touched the lights? David. She said that the house has, like, electrical okay, problems. No, no, right? let's freaking go. I'm done with okay, this, bro. Yo, like yo, yo, okay, what did you guys oh, actually no, do that? We did it, bro. We were all here we were, watching the EMF. I was right next to you, so it wasn't you know, me. Cam camera off, though? Like, off camera. Like, did you guys actually I see it? Bro, do we were it. literally with you with the EMF, bro. This is getting serious, bro. Yo, what the hell? Okay, can we leave? Can you, can yeah, you just bro, go? Can we At close least to another room. Close the freaking closet door. She's like... Oh, oh, yo, show me squad, show me squad. What the hell? Yo, yo, guys, get out, get, get out, get out, get out. No, I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Get out. Bro, what did we just okay, go okay, through, bro? What was that? Bro, yo, I said don't open footage. that door. Yo, let me watch the footage. Yeah, the door was closing behind yes, me. Yes, it was closing behind you. I told you not you to open that door, fam. Okay, let me let me watch the footage. Steve See what I mean? You? It's definitely because we opened it. Because you opened yes, it. Yes, Kyle, bro. Not the Yo, what if, what if, is pissed, bro. What if whatever entity haunts this house, the boogeyman, what if we released it now? Like, what if they locked him in there so he wouldn't bother us while we stayed here? And now we released him into the house. Well, I don't know. We're going to have to figure that out the hard way. How would we, we just know that? get a hotel though? or something and get the hell out of here, bro. I'm not feeling good about it. I guess this. the only way you can tell where he is is by that, right? Yo, I don't know if we should stay here the night. Who's that? I think someone's at the door. Is this someone at the door? Bro. Bro, I really don't like this. Did someone get like, family, order or something? Bro, why would it be the family? Yeah, bro, because in the reviews yeah, they who's, said. Who's knocking in the middle of nowhere? You think it's the family? Why would it be oh, the family? Yo, it is, it is. Look, look, look. You can see her. Oh my god. Yo, that's not, that's not. Okay, why are they here? Okay, yo, just don't, 
don't don't tell them don't the tell them we opened the closet, okay? No matter what. Yeah, don't tell them we opened the closet. Oh my god, it's not gonna be good. Why is she so close to the watch? Hi, how are you doing? I know it's only been 30 minutes, but we just came back to check on you. Everything okay? You kept everything in its place, right? You kept everything yeah, supposed to be, right? Yeah, everything no, is just yeah, the way yeah, it should yeah, be. No, uh, are you okay? It, uh, it, 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 no, 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 no. He's out. He's out. He's out. I know he's out. I heard him. He's out. Something's out. He's 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 out. What? The door. The door. No, we didn't door, open you the didn't open the door. door. Did you open the door? No, Why did we you didn't open the door. We told you not open the door. What? What the hell is we going on? We did not open the door. No, guys, we didn't open the door. Oh, we, God, we didn't open it, guys. We told you. We told you. It's... You opened it. What did you do? No, you opened it. What did you do? It was closed. We told you not to open it. We didn't open it. It was... It just opened on its own. Open on it. Okay, no guys, we opened it for like five seconds and then we, we closed it. Why would you open it? Why would you open it? it? I mean, it can't be that bad. What's no, what's the big deal? You don't understand. He's here. He's You'll here. Know. We're sorry. Guys, what's bad? We're sorry. Guys. We told them. We told them not to open it. It's, a, it's okay. Guys, guys, it'll, be, it'll, be, it'll, be, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah, get what's coming. It'll be fine. All right. It's going to be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. Let's just get the hell out of this yeah, house, bro. Yeah, we need bro. to go. We need to go. We need to go. It's I don't know what the hell is going on right now, but the oh. family that lives in this house just freaked out because we opened up that boogeyman closet, which we shouldn't have, man. Yeah, you Dude, should I have think, done that. I think it might be time for us to leave now. Let's get the hell out of here. Yo, we need to go, leave. Go, 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 go. Yo, he's right there. Yo, okay. kid. We Sir? warned you. Now you will have to deal with it. Bro, screw that, bro. No, yo, yo, open, yes. open, open, open it. Yo, we just locked it. Bro, okay, but then let's unlock just it, lock bro. It. Bro, it's not unlocking. Why is it? It's not this opening. This guy's actually insane. Okay, th it. No, there you must be another. Lock it. Bro, there must be another door, bro. Why did you lock it from the outside? Uh, no, uh, the master bedroom. There yeah. was a, the, the back door, the back door. Go, yeah. go, 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 go. Bro, come on. Come on. I warn you. We tried, and now you're gonna pay. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Man, what the hell is with these people, bro? You don't want to the door. Guys, open the door. We don't want to be in here anymore. Let us out. This isn't funny anymore. Bro, where the hell is what is she doing? Home, okay, what is she actually doing? Actually crazy. Yo, it's not open. Is there, is there any other exits, like a window or anything? This is getting serious. Is there any other way we can get out of the house? I don't see anything. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Quick, quick, Strowman, let's go. Go, 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 there's a window here, there's a window here. Ah, ah, ah. No, 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 no. Oh, yo, yo, he just closed it. Yo, it's bro. locked. Oh, it's locked. Freaking gosh. What? It's Every exit, on. bro. Okay, let's go to the other room. No, there's literally nowhere else there's to go. There's nowhere else. We're literally stuck in this house with the freaking. I think Yo, this was all a part of some big plot. They're like sacrificing us to the boogeyman guys, or something. Guys. Okay, we need to figure out something to do. Uh, uh, literally Sorry, squad. This is a bad situation Does right now. The family service? has literally turned on us. I knew there was something wrong with them. We're gonna try to think of something. I will pick the camera up when we do. All right, let's try going downstairs. Okay, and go, just, go, go. Let's try calling somebody. See if we can call for help. I don't have service right now. All right, Stromedy Squad. Guys, it's been like another 30 minutes now. We've been contemplating what we should do. We don't know what the hell's going on with the owners of the house. Clearly, they're not letting us leave. We have no service, so we can't even call for help. But the thing they keep repeating is that we're gonna pay the consequences for opening up the door. Apparently, whatever lingers in the closet, we let it free. We've angered it, and if we're gonna be spending the night here, the last thing we would want is an angry spirit. So we're all gathered around the table. We're going to try to communicate with it now 
apologize. And we're gonna be recording audio on the phone to try to capture anything for you guys, any voices. The phone can pick up higher frequencies than our ears, so maybe we'll be able to catch something. Okay, just nobody like, sit in this seat right here. Yeah, and nobody make any jokes. Like, like this is very serious. Yeah. Be respectful. Because if you make jokes, like... I know, we already have an angry them, as you know? it is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, very respectful throughout the whole time. Alright, you ready? Whenever you start. Testing, test, test, test. All right, Strong Squad, so you guys can see the voice waves right here. So when we ask it a question, we'll be able to see if the phone's picking up any audio from whatever entities in this house. Okay, ready? Yeah. All right, we're gathered here to try to gain contact with an entity that we've been told resides in this house. We come in peace and respect, and we come to apologize if we angered you in any way. We did not mean to. It was not our intention to insult you, and we're sorry for opening up the door when we know we shouldn't have, and uh, we uh, hope you can forgive us. If you would forgive us, can you please give us a sign? If there's somebody here with us right now, please give us a sign. If you can hear us right now, please try to communicate with us through the phone. You can say anything. Is there anybody here with us now? Any spirit that haunts this house? If you have anything to say, now's the time to do it. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that? Wait, did you no, see that wasn't us. That one, that one it voice, was that one up. Ask it again, ask it again, ask it again. Is there anyone here with us right now? Are you mad at us right now? Okay, we're extremely sorry if we insulted you. Uh, that was not our intentions. Um, we don't want any problems. If you don't like us recording, we'll put the cameras down. Give us a sign if you would like us to stop recording. Okay, I'm gonna play it back okay. right now. Strongly squad, okay, let's listen. Try to gain contact with an entity that we've been told resides in this house. Is there anybody here with us now? Any spirit that haunts this house? If you have anything to say, now's the time to do it. <gasps> so I am here. Did you guys see it? Did you guys see it? No, that wasn't us. That one. That I am here. Did you see that? That wasn't any of us. Listen, listen, listen. Is there anyone here with us right now? Is it yes? Is it yes? Yo, yo, yo. I actually just got a heart attack. Did I just stay completely silent so it's not Are you mad at us right now? Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, it's mad at us. Are we gonna get out, bro? They locked all the doors. They locked all the doors. We can't even get out. Bro, it's mad at us. We literally pissed it off. Okay, we're extremely sorry if we insulted you. Uh, that was not our intentions. Um, we don't want any problems. If if you don't like us recording, we'll put the cameras down. Give us a sign if you would like us to stop recording. <laughs> 
Yo, no, no camera. Ouija, Ouija. Ouija as in... You guys hear... Let me play it again. Let me play it again. If, if no you don't like us Ouija, recording, Ouija. put the cameras down. Give us a sign if you would like us to stop recording. Listen, listen. It's very quiet. No camera, Ouija, Ouija. Ouija, Ouija. Like it wants to communicate through Ouija. That makes Throw sense. It's way board. easier for it to communicate that way. Through Ouija. Oh my God. Dude, Strong no, is going. Did you freaking that. hear that? That gives it more power. power. Yeah, it's insane. Yeah, no, you not the point. Yo, we asked if it was evil. We need to know what it said. Yeah, yeah, yo. Yo, keep but playing. Wait, wait, to find out if it's evil okay, or not. Okay, okay. You asked it if it's good or evil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's coming up. Are you a good or evil spirit? Please, 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 please. Okay, no, 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 bro, 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 Okay, Stromedy Squad, so about another 30 minutes has gone by. You guys saw, I guess I should say, heard what happened over there when we tried to contact whatever entity lingers in this house. We heard it say at one point, no camera, Ouija, Ouija. So we actually brought a Ouija board with us. We're gonna try to contact that same spirit now and see what happens. Because I think they would like would prefer to communicate through this. You know, it's more clear. It's way easier. Yeah. Than life. Okay, everyone put your fingers on. Does it work two fingers or okay one? guys, so one, there's one three rules to the Ouija board. Rule number one, probably the most important one, is always say goodbye. So once we're done, we have to say goodbye. Otherwise, whatever spirit is talking to you can latch onto you and oh. that's how people get possessed. Okay, we don't want this coming home with us, so. Rule number two is never take your fingers off the planchette. And rule number three is never laugh or disrespect the spirit. Yeah, no okay. jokes, like no that's jokes. That's a given, that's a given. All right, Stromedy Squad, you guys are used to seeing us joke around on this channel, but nothing is more serious than the Ouija board. This could go wrong very quickly, so we actually have to respect it. Okay, ready? Ouija, Ouija, Ouija. Are there any spirits here in this house that would like to communicate with us? We're calling out the spirit that just came through on the phone, the one we were talking with in the dining room. If you're here, please move the planchette to yes. Is anyone here with us right now? Yo, I feel it like trying to move. Dude, you have no resistance. You guys feel that temperature drop in the room? Yeah. Dude, I feel yeah. like we just got those photos. It feels like whatever was in the dining room just came into the kitchen. Try again, ask again. Um, oh, do you see the candle just move? Did you just enter the room? Oh, no, 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 it just went to yes, it just went to yes. Okay, okay. Okay, are you the same spirit we were just talking with? Yes. Okay, um, are you, are you mad at us? Yo, Dude, that was like, quick. Yeah, it's moving quickly. That means it's angry because the angrier they are, the more power they have to move in. Why are you mad at us? Wait, still moving. Oh? P? E? N? Open. 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 Open what? The door. The door, door. Oh. The door upstairs? But we really should have. <gasps> Yo. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so that means. Confirmed it. So you're mad at us because we opened the closet door? Okay. Who told us not to do that. Okay, who who are you? S O N The Son <gasps> The Son oh. Like the story The Son of the Family that currently lives here told us. Remember he was telling us there was a son that didn't something that he felt died. like he deserved to live here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, yo, yo. <gasps> yes, 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 yes. Okay, uh, what happened to you? W? 
A T E R Water. 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 Because remember they said that he oh, drowned. Every, okay, then everything he, they told like us is the true. river right over like there. Right in front Wait, of yeah, the house. Yeah, is, is it the river right in front of the house? His body was literally right there. We're like a couple yeah, meters away from him. Right okay, are you okay with us filming right now? No. Dude, we have to turn the but camera. Do we turn the camera? Like, Dude, we can't keep this. There's no point doing it. Yeah, yeah, and it's also for our safety. Where in this house do you live? C. L. We open, fam. Okay, why won't the family let us leave? M. E. Me. Like him, like the. Yeah, like that. Okay, wait, let's think. Just want the answers. Wait, let's think. Dude, he's like listening. What, what could he be mean by me? Like how, do, how does them not letting us leave tie? So you? ask him, ask him. Uh, like what does that mean? Like, uh, okay. what do you want from us? Like, okay, what do you want from us? Uh, S? Uh, o? So? so uh, you? So? So? Uh, L? Okay, bro. Soul? Soul! Okay, bro. Okay, no, 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 no. Bro, this is. I think we need to say goodbye. Can, can okay. we say goodbye? Yo, dude, dude, that was dude. the quickest response. What is it? Uh, bro, what's it's coming back to no again. Bro, just, just, oh my gosh, just okay, keeps going okay, to no. We need to okay. say goodbye quickly. Think. Um, where, where are you standing right now? No, it's turning. Bro, 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 bro. Bro, 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 it's going Yo, off it's the going board! It's off the board, it's going off the board! It's pointing right, right here? There. It's, it's standing uh, right next to me, it's standing right next to me. Okay, put it on the board, Nick. The project are, can never leave the board. Are you right next to Kyle? <gasps> Why is that it's right next to me? It's right next to me. Okay, guys, we gotta just say goodbye. Just force it to goodbye. Go. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Goodbye. Take your hands off. Yo! Yo, yo, yo! Yo, yo, yo! Yo! Oh. How did those just go out? Dude, How did the plane just move? Like literally that? just flew past me. Yo, what the Dude, it's okay, on bro. the ground. Okay, bro, we don't touch it. Don't touch it. Don't yeah, touch no, no, okay, it. Bro, don't, don't touch anything. Doing, it's so present right okay, now. Okay, guys, we gotta end this. Yo, 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 yo. Dude, yo, yo, I need yo, this what the right hell? now. Just... We need to get out. Yo, okay, everyone quiet. Everyone quiet. Okay, let's just leave. I don't think it wants to talk anymore. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Bro. Okay, we need to go. We just forced a goodbye. The spirit is incredibly mad right now, guys. I think we need to just leave this room. All right. Okay, Strawberry Squad, it's a little bit later. Update, we're gonna try to sleep it off, but I don't know about you. I'm no, not gonna I literally, sleep in here. but to be honest, I'd rather sleep through the night than be awake and like deal with more of this like paranormal stuff. Yeah, but how are we able to sleep knowing that the family's outside? Like they're probably watching us right Dude, now. All I know is we were told to respect the space. If we're just good and quiet until the morning, maybe we can just like leave. I don't know, Yana. I feel like they have ulterior motives. They're plotting something, and whatever spirits in this house, we've already angered it. I don't think it would be smart to sleep. So what do you want? Dude. I don't know, I say we just waited out till morning. Dude, literally on the article Val was reading, it says it gets worse around 3 a.m. I don't want to be awake for that. Yeah, guys, it's probably like, what, midnight right now? Yeah, dude, like 3 a.m. is close. I want to be knocked out by then. Okay, so, Strawberry Squad, this is what I was thinking. We're probably going to set up some security cameras in each person's room to see if we can capture any footage throughout the night. This has already by far been one of the scariest videos I've ever done on this channel. You guys can see our vibe has totally changed throughout the night. It's just the furnace. It's just the furnace. I don't feel comfortable in here. Dude, can we just try to leave? I don't like this. I really don't like this. Let's just pack our stuff, go. We can't. The family's not letting us. All the doors are locked. We, can't and we have no service in here. We can hop out of a window. We can't. It's too high up. This is way too high up. Strawberry Squad, this is one of the worst situations we've been in. And why do we have the freaking room with the closet? 
Why did you open the closet is my question. I don't know. I was just trying to get a good video. And now we've angered the spirit. The family won't let us leave. And who knows what else is going to happen. We still have like six hours until morning. How can we please just go to bed, okay? 3 a.m. is literally right around the corner. Sharmity Squad, do you guys see what we do for you? We are literally putting ourselves in the worst position possible. We're going to set up the cameras. You guys are going to have to be our eyes and ears. If you see anything throughout the night, comment the timestamp and let us know, okay? All right, let's just try to get through it. Okay, I'm going to set up the camera somewhere over here. Maybe we should, like, take turns. Like, you sleep, I sleep. You sleep, I sleep. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, I'll see you in the morning. Yo, what? We just saw the boogie man. We just saw the boogie man. Open our closet. You open our closet. We saw his hands, dude. I'm not joking. We're not joking. Can we leave right now? Get out of here right now. Val, 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 Val,
the dude, let's try another one. Let's try another one. Oh, Guys, I'm telling you, we're all a part of some big plot right now. Guys, go through the back. Try the back. Try the back. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god. Yo, it's the dad. It's the dad. He's just standing there. He's just standing there. Yo, we can't go this way. Turn back, turn back. Go, 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 go. Why are they in the I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I think they're like working with the boogeyman. Try this window. Oh, yo, 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 the mom's there. The mom's there. Yo, we need to go back. They're surrounding the house. They're making it impossible for us to leave, bro. Okay, let's try the dining room. Try the dining room. Go, 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 go. Try the dining room. Try the dining room. Okay, let's try this. Let's go. Oh, yo, 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 yo. Is it open? There's the doors there. These guys really need to relax, man. It's not that What are they all doing just standing there? They don't want us to leave. All right, go back. Go back. Go back. Baby. This is getting really messed up. This is getting super messed up. What else do you want us to do? We did everything you asked. You've been terrorizing our family for years. How much longer is this going to go on? Okay, I know what to do. Somebody's walking in, somebody's walking in. Oh my god, oh my god. Yo, yo, guys. Shh, quiet, quiet. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, yo, yo. What do you guys want? Leave us alone. Guys, leave, leave, leave us alone. All we want to do is go back home. We're so sorry. We didn't mean to. Yeah, we didn't. We, we didn't mean to disrespect you guys or anything. Don't worry. It'll be all done soon. Done soon. What do you mean, done soon? You shouldn't have opened the doors. Look, we, we don't want no part of this, this sick game of yours. You mean have fun in hell? Don't worry, it won't be long now. What are they It'll talking happen. about? Guys, can you just please let us out? We just want to go home. Dude, we won't tell anyone about this. We just want to go home as if nothing ever happened, okay? You won't tell anyone anything because you'll be dead. Dead? What does he mean, dead? What do you mean, what does he mean? I say, I say, I'm free. We just make a run for it or something. Okay. Look, you guys are gonna seriously regret this, okay? You're not gonna get away with this. We'll be fine. Everything's going to be fine. We're gonna be okay. We're gonna be fine. What are they talking about? He's here. What? Who's here? I'm not getting good vibes right now. What? Oh, my closet. Oh, my God. Guys. Yo, yo, yo. Guys. No, no, no. No, 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 Guys, 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 no, 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 no. What the hell is going on right now? Go, go, go. Guys, 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 Let's leave them now. No, 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 guys, don't leave us. You can't leave us. No, Yana, Yana, Yana. Guys, 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 we need to get out of here right now. We need to get out of here. We need to leave right now. Let's go get the police or something. Maybe they can help us. Oh, my God, Yana, are you good? 
No! Hey guys, run, run, go, run, 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 run. Bro, we need to go check on Yeah, Go, 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 go. Yo, 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 go, 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 Oh, oh, oh. 